This short video will show you how to export references from any of our EBSCO databases into EndNote. Now it doesn't matter which EBSCO database you choose to use, the principles are the same no matter which one you do use. Do your search and then you will find that next to each reference in your list you've got a greyed out folder option. To put any of your references into EndNote simply click onto the folder option which turns it yellow and then go to folder view. Select that reference again and then export your reference. Now you'll see that the um, default option is to direct export in RIS format and this is the one that you need to export into EndNote. Click on to save. Now it could, me, it could be that in some occasions you have to open up the download in order to complete the export. In Chrome you'll find this is at the bottom of the page. Simply click onto that and open. Once you click onto open your EndNote library will open up and your references will export. As always, check the references for the quality of data and then move them into one of your groups.